Right, Paul, what do I see in your hand? Uh, my latest incarnation, um, so bicopter. Sorry, bicopter or dual copter. Um, you may have seen my Chinook uh, to be featured on Bob's channel. Um, this is now uh, the next step on. It uses tilt motors rather than the twisting I had earlier. Um, it's not quite finished. The wiring's a bit loose. Um, it's only had one flight indoors, so let's see what happens. <laughs> <laughs> we shall see then. That didn't look strange at all. Too bad for a second flight. No, it's pretty good. I'm not liking it in the wind at the moment. <sighs> it looks reasonably stable. Yeah, it's not stable, it's a bit twitchy on the control. Yeah, to, yeah. Get that one right. I think I'm cover it, I'm not confident with it yet. No. Figure out what it does. I can fix that. I wouldn't say it was strange looking. <laughs> Looks like something out of Doctor Who. Got a noisy motor on there though, that needs to be fixed. Yeah. What's moved quite quickly, I can tell you that. <laughs> <laughs> Did it? Holding it back. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's a modified version of my own flight controller code. Yeah. It's pretty simple to modify. As long as you know what you're doing. Yeah. You certainly are. <laughs> Where'd he go? Here it is. That's pretty much too bad. Yeah. I've got another flying sideways. <laughs> oh, cool. That was me, sorry. <laughs> that went, was you? Went to catch it and hit the roll. <laughs> <laughs> Trying to be cocky. Yeah. Very good. So, um, yeah. it will have ball joints on it. They're still in the post, coming from China. Yeah. Um, it's all CNC cut and 3D printed. There's no glue on that, it just all slots together. Uh-huh. Uh, 2S battery. AliExpress three pound motors and props. Yeah. Not bad. Pretty good. Nice bit of fun. <laughs>